Arduino has extremely limited available memory. The 2 kilobytes or uh, 2048 bytes are shared between your data and uh, with the stack to run your program. So in reality, you have less than 2 kilobytes available for your data. In this video, I'm going to show to you how to use memory more efficiently. Let's say we want to take some measurements and need to store an analog input value and two digital input values. Create a structure for the data. Unside int, since we do not need negative values. And two boolean variables for the digital inputs. I will print the size of the structure out from the serial port. As you can see, it takes up 4 bytes. Integer on Arduino is 2 bytes and despite Boolean needing only 1 bit, it will still take up a whole byte since it is the minimum addressable memory unit on Arduino. C++ has a feature called bit fields that allows you to chop bytes into smaller bits to use available memory more efficiently. So let's redeclare the same structure. Analog read only returns values from 0 to 1023. This is 10 bits of data. By adding colon 10 at the end of the variable name, we say to the compiler that we only need 10 bits of the two bytes that int takes. Next, let's add two digital input variables and they both take one bit of memory. We have still 4 bits left over. I will name those as reserve. So later, if we need to store another value that fits into 4 bits, we basically can store it for free. Now if we look at the size of the new struct, it says that it is only 2 bytes. Bit fields can be used as any normal structure member. The only limitation is that uh, this value cannot exceed 1023. It starts to matter when we turn those variables into arrays. By storing 500 elements, the original data structure will eat up almost all the memory. Our compacted structure will only take up half of the memory for the same amount of data stored. Of course, this comes with a little overhead because compiler has to generate some code to extract the data out of those specified bits. But usually for most Arduino projects, memory is bigger limitation than time. Thank you for watching.